Guys, it's Connor Kuliak here. I apologize that I didn't upload on Sunday. Some stuff was going on. And I'm sorry that I'm uploading on Wednesday. Um, I'm not going to be really uploading consistently on all of my channels. Because a lot of people have been... Well, not a lot, but a few friends of mine have been complaining that I've been uploading a lot. So I'm going to stop doing that. I'm sorry. Anyway, today we're going to be reacting to Bruce Lee. Now, this YouTuber is like one of... One, I guess he's one of um, the YouTube animators in this community right now. Um, this video is called Tommy's House. So, hope you guys enjoy. And the original video will be in the description. Anyway, let's enjoy. Alright. Now, usually when you're growing up, you tend to have a friend... There's the police sirens right now. Had to interrupt my freaking video, huh? Alright, just ignore the Kogi sirens. Alright, now usually when you're growing up, you tend to have a friend that you like hanging out with, but you don't really like going to their house. And for me, well, that I mean, I'm not grown up yet, but I do have a friend named, named Gabriel, or I did something. Uh, he was in my Carnage TV video. Um, I sometimes go to his house. I mean, I go to his house a lot, but... He hasn't been really coming to my house. He came today, but he was, I don't know why he was, I don't know what he was doing, but yeah. He, 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 he doesn't really come to my house often. All right, let's um, keep reacting. That was my friend Tommy. Now, I didn't like going to Tommy's house for a couple of reasons. For one, his house had a weird smell to it. And by weird... Well, I can't smell, so... Yeah, that's a problem that I can't smell for some reason. So, yeah smell i mean as soon as you walk in you'd be like ah oh, sick somebody microwaving socks in a daddy's bathroom what the <laughs> hell is that and for two his family yo i'm sorry that was hilarious he wasn't the most pleasant people to be around his mom had a bunch of weird ass rules that you'd have to follow when you were there you're not allowed to use our bathroom you hear me i don't know where you came from or who your parents are so you're not allowed to take a piss in this house and then you had tommy's creepy ass grandma who would always talk to me but i could never understand what she was saying because she talked like fucking job of the hut from star wars uh, <laughs> job of the hut <laughs> of course you been not chopping yeah this is funny <laughs> Dude, what the hell is she saying? Is she about to freeze me in carbonite? <laughs> I don't know, maybe. <laughs> so needless to say, Tommy's yeah, house. Bruce Lee was really hilarious a lot. Like, I like his videos. I've been, I have been wa I, I've been watching his video for a while. Suck ass. But there was one redeeming factor about Tommy's house, and that was that he had a PlayStation 2. And I'll never forget the day that Tommy got Grand Theft Auto 3. It was so he was like, this was like back in 19, I don't know, something. But, no, no, maybe not 19 something. It was like probably in the 2000s. Because if he had a PS2. Well, okay. Maybe he had a PS2, but he didn't have a PS3 yet. Or the PS3 wasn't out and he had a PS2. I'm confused. And Grand Theft Auto 3, I remember playing that game. My brother loves the theme song to it. Have a, listen, to, listen to this theme song right here. Yeah, it's crazy. All right, back to the video. It's like a goddamn national holiday to us. I'm hanging out in front of my house with my next door neighbor, Michael. I got my sweet Dwayne The Rock Johnson hat on, looking like a hard ass. Whoa, careful, honey. I can smell what that kid's cooking, and I don't want to be a part of it. All of a sudden, Tommy <laughs> comes up to us. <laughs> you guys want to come over and play PlayStation 2 at my house? Oh, and deal with your mean-ass mom and your weird-ass grandma? No, thank you. <laughs> my hey, what's that? Is I only have, like, one... Friend that I go to his house and that gets and that gig roll. So yeah. My grandma's dead. Now, side note here, Tommy would always lie about stuff, all the time, for absolutely no reason. And he would always lie about his grandma being dead. Now, why would he do that? What? I don't know. Tommy's a sick fuck, I guess. He would lie about his grandma being dead, and you would feel all bad for him. Then you'd go over to his house, and you'd see her Why would he lie about his grandmother being dead Tommy, if he obviously dead. saw her alive in the wheelchair? <laughs> Come on, dude, I got Grand Theft Auto 3. Oh, uh, hell yeah, Grand Theft Auto 3? I want to run over some hookers with an ice cream truck. Calm down, yeah, Michael, just calm do you really want to deal with Tommy's weird ass grandma? <laughs> I just told you my grandma's dead. God damn it, Tommy, she's not dead. You're a liar and you're lying just like the time you told me that your cousin was on an episode of Boy Meets. Oh, yeah, I have a, yeah, my friend Gabriel, he lies a lot. I, okay, Gabriel, I know you're watching this video right now, but listen, you do lie a lot, okay? It's not a joke, you lie, okay? Like one time, you lied about. 
Oh, Kuya Kor, that you had a Kuya Kor. He has a Kuya Kor now, but before he never had a Kuya Kor, he lied about it. And yes, you're, you're saying, oh, but I didn't say I had a Kuya Kor. I said I had a, I had a Lego made out of Kuya. I mean, no, I meant to say that I had a Kuya Kor made out of Lego. How can you make, uh, I, I forgot how much, um, how, how much size in the Kuya Kor. Here, here you go. Here's the picture. Yeah, like seriously, that's man. That's man. That's man large or small or I don't know to make a PS4 out of Lego. Okay, stop talking. All right, that's the video. Twirl. <laughs> he was though. Are we gonna run over hookers with an ice cream truck or what? So we walk into Tommy's house. We're all gung ho, ready to commit some felonies. Ah, oh, sick. Why does it smell like a dog shit in a bag of Fritos in here? I look over to the other side of the living room, and sure as shit, there's Tommy's grandma, alive and well. <laughs> <laughs> God what damn it, I knew it. Boys. Tommy, what is the matter with you? You're like the little boy that cried my grandma's death. So we start heading to Tommy's bedroom, and all of a sudden, Tommy's grandma has the audacity to take my sweet Dwayne the Rock Johnson hat right off the top of my head. Hey, what the hell? Tommy, you better get your grandma under control before I tip her ass out of the wheelchair. We don't like hats in this house. You can get it when you leave. I don't know where you came from and who your parents are, so there's no wow, hats in this house. Up. And if you gotta take a piss, there's a tree in the backyard you can use. So I have to cut my losses and let Tommy's weird ass grandma have my hat for the time being and we go in his room and play some goddamn Grand Theft Auto 3 but there's one big problem that's stopping us the goddamn game disc is all scratched up oh, and we can't get the thing to work Jesus. we have a bunch of game discs that are scratched we're not a bunch but we used to have a lot of we used to like receive game discs that was like scratched so yeah Tommy, where'd you find this game? Out in the street? <laughs> My sister's boyfriend gave it to me. What, after he was done wiping his ass with it? This thing is all jacked up. It's got more scratches oh, wow. in it than a fucking lottery ticket. How the hell are we gonna get this thing to work? I heard if you put toothpaste on the disc, it helps get rid of the scratches. That's Michael, not, not gonna help, toothpaste okay? On the disc. Do Don't not be ridiculous. That, was the game got fucking gingivitis? Hey, I'm just trying to be constructive. All I want to do is run over some hookers with a goddamn ice cream truck. So there <laughs> we were, squeezing out toothpaste on this goddamn Grand Theft Auto 3 game disc, hoping that it just might work. We put the oh, game yeah, back in the PlayStation, about, so. and you wouldn't believe me if I told you, but somehow Michael's bullshit toothpaste method totally did not work at all. Are you fucking kidding me? We squirted like a half tube of Colgate on the damn thing. Not oh, only did well. the game not work, but we probably <laughs> fucked up Tommy's Great, PlayStation no 2 while we were at it. <laughs> it's making some weird noises. So there was no Grand Theft Auto 3 that day, which meant there was no running over hookers with an ice cream truck. Ah, oh, darn it! Me and Michael were so mad we just left Tommy's truck. house. And it wasn't until I got home that I realized, oh, Damn it! I left my sweet Dwayne the Rock Johnson hat with Tommy's weird ass grandma. And after that day, I didn't see Tommy for weeks. Finally, like a month goes by, and I go back to Tommy's house. Hey, I need my sweet Dwayne the Rock Johnson hat back. Where's your weird ass grandma? Mm. <laughs> Dude, my grandma died. God damn it, Tommy! I'm not doing this. Your grandma's not dead. She doesn't oh, die. She's like the Terminator of all time. grandmas. Oh shit! She really is dead this time, isn't she? Uh, whoops. Oh my god. Well, that was the end of the video, guys. That video was really funny. I know I didn't really laugh that much because, um, I don't know why. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. Um, the original link of this video will be in the description. Um, subscribe to Bruce Drew. Um, he's a really funny animator. And he tells really good, funny stories. My opinion, he's kind of funnier than the odd ones out or dating animation. Um, yeah. Anyway, thank you guys for watching this video, and as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.